Fine. Turn around. <laughs> okay. Oh my God! Ah! Hi, I'm Lauren Good with The Verge, and I'm about to do a demo of something that I can honestly say I've never gotten done before. I'm getting a hologram made of myself. We're at 8i Studios in Los Angeles. Let's go take a look. 8i has been around since 2014, making virtual reality videos that require a 41 camera setup. And the videos are usually only viewable through a virtual reality headset. And these are the 41 cameras. They're, they're 2K cameras. All the hardware that you see is off the shelf hardware and then all the magic happens in the software. Those video streams get processed and using our proprietary software transformed into a fully volumetric photorealistic hologram that looks indistinguishable from you. But now 8i wants to make its volumetric content available to everyday smartphone users. The company is currently testing a new mobile app called Holo, which lets you interact with holograms, no headset required. So as a part of the formal unveiling of the app at our recent Code Media event, we made a hologram, which despite the highly technical setup, ended up being as easy as taping a non-holographic video. You can go ahead and put it on, and as you know, like you'll have some grid come up when it's when you've gotten to the border. Turn around. Okay. Oh my god! Ah! Oh my god, I'm even nerdier in a hologram. Why is it that you need something that has texture or pattern to it? So it's the way that the capture system works. If it's something like a, a solid, for example, like a solid black, you're not catching enough shadows amongst what you're seeing. It's the sort of being able to, to sense the texture and the, and the way that the different cameras are seeing that is what results in a great hologram. We're about to take a look at some really cool, exclusive holographic technology that hasn't been seen before. Hey, hey, I thought I was supposed to be doing the demo. What the heck? What is, where, where am I? So, yeah, so Lauren came to visit us in Culver, in Culver City and, and, and we recorded you in about a, an hour or so, you can have a full 3D asset. You might not recognize this smartphone though, and that's because it's a highly specialized Lenovo smartphone. It has a bunch of different sensors and runs Google's Tango software. So while you don't need a VR headset to see 8i holograms, you will need this type of phone. And there are very few of them out there right now. 8i also hasn't totally figured out yet how it plans to make money. Right now, the most important thing for 8i is, is that lots of people come up with really creative things to do with the holograms. And if, if that happens, then people will download them. If people download them, use them, and share them, we'll make money. Steve Raymond, 8i, thank you so much. Thank you very much. Thanks for watching. For more videos like this, go to recode.net and theverge.com.